Generative AI is helping developers build all sorts of applications. Foundation models and APIs make it easy to start and develop these AI-driven applications to solve all kinds of business challenges. In this video, you will learn how you can leverage Vertex AI and LangChain to build generative AI-driven applications. Getting started with a use case is easy. Let's say you want to use a large language model. The first step is choosing a model like the Vertex AI Palm API. Then you design and write your prompt. After that, you will check the quality of the response and improve if needed. So far, so good. But wait, what if I have a more complex use case? Like one where I want to leverage real-time data or combine the power of multiple large language models? Well, then we have to deal with some challenges. Out of the box, large language models only have access to knowledge in their training data. What if you want an LLM to use data it has never seen before, like today's weather forecasting or the latest sales data? Also, there are use cases where you need to orchestrate multiple steps before getting the desired outcome. Okay, let's look at some common design patterns to help you better understand this. So your first use case might be one where you want to include data from external sources like a database or an API. This way, you can embed the latest data in your prompt to help improve your model's performance. Another example could be a use case where you need to do multiple calls to your large language models to get the desired outcome, like when you want to summarize large documents. A third example could be a pattern where one model's output goes into the next, chaining multiple models together. But how can you implement these patterns? Well, there are different ways. One, you can write boilerplate code to stitch it all together. Another option is using a framework as a layer of abstraction and orchestration. One of these frameworks is LangChain. LangChain is a framework that offers flexible abstractions that developers can use to build LLM-driven applications. LangChain enables applications that are data-aware, so connecting a model to other sources, agentic allowing a language model to interact with its environment. So how does LangChain fit with Vertex AI? As you may know, Vertex AI gives you access to Google's generative AI to build AI-powered applications. Vertex AI offers integration with the LangChain's Python SDK, making it convenient to build applications on top of Vertex AI. Vertex AI and LangChain have integrations for services like the Vertex AI Palm API for text, chat and embeddings, Vertex AI vector search, and Vertex AI search. Also, as you may have seen at Google Cloud Next, we're enabling the ability to click to deploy LangChain applications to Vertex AI with Vertex AI extensions. This means that you don't have the hassle of having to spin up and manage your environment. Stay tuned for more integrations to come. OK, it's time for some code. Let's look at a basic example on using the Palm API and LangChain for summarizing large documents. First, to use the Vertex AI Palm API and LangChain, you make sure that the Vertex AI and LangChain SDK are installed in your environment. Next, you have to import the libraries. From LangChain's LLMs, you will need to import the Vertex AI class. Then set the text bison model as our default because it's great for summarization. Next, you will have to create your prompt templates that you will use as predefined recipes. This example uses LangChain's MapReduce method to implement a multi-stage process to summarize large pieces of text by first summarizing smaller chunks of text and then combining those summaries into a single summary. After defining the templates, you initialize the associated MapReduce chain and then generate summaries using the chain. This will generate the summary. OK, now how can this help you as a Gen AI developer? Using Vertex AI and LangChain can accelerate your generative AI development lifecycle, where LangChain is an abstraction layer. You can build many use cases, like improving customer support through a chat interface that leverages LLMs, explore fast amounts of unstructured data through conversational interfaces, and summarize large documents to consume information faster and many more. Okay, 
let's wrap this up. In this video, you learned how can you use Vertex AI with LangChain to build generative AI-powered applications, and how to use the Vertex AI and LangChain SDK integration to build solutions. Check out the link below to learn more about generative AI with Vertex AI. Thanks for watching, and definitely let us know in the comments what you are building with generative AI.